Hello guys, the Master Duel Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time I'm going to be playing some tier limit on ladder, and let's go ahead and hop right in, I gotta go ahead and switch to the tier deck list, there we go, and then hop in, and let's see, so we're currently diamond tier 4, trying to rank up a little bit, um, okay, oh, and they're on a rank down game, that's not, it's not a good look for them, oh, and I win the rock paper scissors shoot, not a crazy good look for them. Okay, hopefully I don't brick. I did add some more um, engine to the deck. I added one Rota to search Rhino and added one Foolish Burial Goods uh, just as like another starter so that way my deck can play more often. And there we go. Let's see, so I got Merly, Scream, Foolish Burial Goods. I feel like I shouldn't activate Foolish Burial Goods and I should just try to play first. So I like Foolish Burial Goods for Solik and then I just like mill Solik. There's like no point in doing that. So summon, summon, effects, chain link one, chain link two. Maybe I should have done merely chain link two, just so that way they can have this mean it gets a little bit wild. Oh jeez. Okay. Well I'm very happy I didn't foolish bureau goods now, but oh man. That's tough. What do I lose? Okay, at least I didn't lose anything. I'll just pass. But I can't play can't play at all that's tough that's tough yeah. oh my gosh yeah there's no way I can beat that that's cra shifter plus Martha so good especially when I draw five engine guards Okay, yeah, there's no point I'm going to be able to kill back, so I'm just going to give him that win. Dang it. Uh, I let him win on the rank down game. I felt like I couldn't do anything there, though. I don't I don't think there was, like, a better play to make. I think I made all the good moves I could. I just got hit with, uh, it's like, a broken combo. But, all right, on to the next one. Um, I'll be going first. Okay, and this is, the, this is a rank up game, right? So I can't let them win a rank up game. That would suck. So, okay, going first again, you know, it can't, can't go that bad, right? It can't go that bad. It's playable. So, I'll take any hand that's playable. Normal summon effect. Just go ahead and dump. Is that good? Alright, nice. Dump, haveness, haveness effect, go to fuse. No chain, summon Kikalos, one, two, summon. And then I'll get the Kikalos effect. Is it gonna go through? Feel like this may get stopped. Hopefully it's with a Valor though. Oh, it actually goes through, okay. Uh, I think it's just search Merly. Obviously I have to search a tier name, so I think it's just Merly. At the hand. I already went through Rhino, so I can't grab that. Effect, target, tag out, cool, summon merely, and then mill eight. One, two, usually I do Kikalos chaining two because I don't care if it gets hit with Ash Blossom, but they, they don't have anything, so it doesn't matter how I chain this. Go mill, mill Calbeck, Havnus, DD Crow, Shuffler, Merly, um, well, this is probably like. Merly chain like one and back two. Yeah, even though I don't think anything I mill off Kelbeck will really change what I go for. Cause I already have like Crow, Kakalo, so I'm not gonna make a Kaleido here. So mill five, they mill five. Oh my god. It's literally every deck is either just macrocosmos, defissure, or tears what it feels like. But okay, I milled Rhino, I milled Scream, I also milled Solik. Wow, okay. That is nice. Um, I don't know if I'm supposed to make Dragos Topalia against their deck. I feel like I'm supposed to make... Or, I mean, Rukalis. I feel like I'm supposed to make Dragos Topalia. Um, yeah. Okay. They also play Board Breakers. What, what's my next play after this, realistically? It's Search, Search... Pass, just do nothing else. Okay, yeah, I'll make Jarvis Paleo. One, two. And then. 
Summon out. Okay, new chain link. Effects. Search Solik. Search Havnus. My max C is not going to be good. My talents isn't going to be good. Search that. Go search out the Solik. And then set one back row. Pass turn. Okay. And I'm thinking I also just drop max C and draw phase. Because their deck doesn't seem like a very normal deck. I feel like I'm not going to get any draws off max C. Other than maybe like Maxi and they summon some Cyber Dragon type card. Maybe a Kaiju. Pot of Extravagance. Okay. That's fine. No response to that. So now they just got seven cards. I still don't know what they're even doing. Yeah, they're gonna go summon border. Alright, that's fine. Start stunning back row. The Solik during end phase looks like it's gonna be good. Uh, I have, what, two names in Graves, so I can use Rhino, Merly, make it Kalos, and then go in the Kaleido next to it. So, negate, send, effect. DD Croak, called by, nope, okay. Summon Aki Kalos. One, two, and then summon out. Okay, and then we already used Merly, so just use this effect. Go dump. I don't want to dump Shaylin because I don't want Shaylin to be at the bottom. But I have to because the only other one is, yeah. I mean, it's like, I don't think it's worth going for Rhino here. Like, Rhino, discard to summon, go dumb. I guess, uh, then I get... Because it's not like Havnus is going to be good in the hand, right? So I could use... Um, the Havnus in the graveyard, the Rhino in the graveyard, the discard Havnus, summon Kaleido, Rhino go dumb, summon Mud. Okay, yeah, so technically it is just this. Add the hand, nope. Dump that, and then effect... So that resolves, summon, discard Havnus, and then we're going to go Rhino effect, Havnus effect, and then I can make Kaleido, so no chain, resolve, summon out the Kaleido, put back, put back, put back. So, one, two, three, doesn't matter, my deck's about to get shuffled. Summon, and then dump the Havnus. Wait, no, because I just used the Havnus effect. I'm supposed to dump the, the Shaylin, yeah. Dump Shaylin, new chain link, Kaleida one to spin back. The border's negated permanently, so that card doesn't matter. So I'm just going to spin a back row, get Shaylin effect, try to make Mud Dragon. So resolve, summon, put back Shaylin, put back Tiggy Crow, and then summon out. Okay, go ahead, hit a back row. Man, the, the power level of tier is just crazy. Okay, pass turn. Also, just like can't look through my graveyard right now because my opponent's just lagging. Like, come on. There we go. Alright, so, won that one. Nice. On to the next one. Hopefully, I don't get hit with Shifter Martha. Or I don't lose the Rock, Paper, Scissors, Shoot against a Macro DeFi deck. Border, all that. All those shenanigans. Okay, I'm gonna go second. I just, I don't even get it. Like, one of those Border decks, they, they're just not fun to me. Like, going first or second, winning or losing, they usually don't feel fun. But okay, okay, okay. Let's find out. What do I draw? I draw Caldo, Medora, Agito, Foolish Barrel, Goods, Merly. So, no hand traps. Uh, I didn't draw any of the large amount that I play. Two Crow, three Ash, three Maxi, three Imperm, two Havnus, two Kelbeck. Okay, so I play 15. I didn't draw any, sadly. 
Yup, no response on my end. Guido's fine. Let's see. They mill Medora, Turtle, Solik. I mill Medora, Solik. So I'm going to activate my Solik effect. They can activate their Solik effect. I'm going to search out Havnus. Also, I really like Tier Limit Cash Tira. I want that card to come out in this. I feel like that card makes the mirror match so much better. Grab Havnus. Maybe that's just my opinion, though. But I like it. Search Havnus. You know, try to keep playing on their turn. They're going to go search. You know, you want to grab Merle. You want to grab Rhino. I was going to say, like, my Havnus will be activated in response to that effect. Yeah, it'll definitely be activated in response to that effect. They're gonna go Medora effect preemptively. I thought they were gonna go normal summon Rhino, Rhino effect, see if I activate Havnus, and then chain Medora in the graveyard to put back my Medora. I mean, what do you wanna put back? Um, they might put back their own turtle. Yeah, put back a Guido, Medora, turtle, sure, no response. I really want them to like target my Solik or something. Just put good mills in my deck. Okay, normal summon Rhino effect. Chain Havnus. Now come on, hit a Shuffler. I know there's only three in the deck right now, but come on. Okay, we do hit a Havnus. We hit another Solik, which sucks, but I'll take I'll take the Havnus. The Solik doesn't really matter. So they're gonna go dump. They've already used Medora. Dump Havnus, Havnus Chain Link 1, Havnus Chain Link 2. Let's see, Resolve. No, I'm not going to Chain a Guido. Okay, Resolve, Summon Kikalos. 1, 2. Almost used the Merle on accident. Definitely want to keep that in my hand right now. Put back, put back. Actually, like, the Double Solik actually really does suck with the Foolish Burial Goods in my hand. Because that means I can't just Rota next turn. But I'm going to get hit with Dweller anyways. I didn't draw enough to stop my opponent. So they're going to put back. Summon out Kikalos. Kikalos Chain Link 1. Kikalos Chain Link 2. And then any response. Oh, I'm trying to think. Discard, summon Rhino. Rhino, Merle. All I get out of it is Rukalos or Kaleido. I could Kaleido the Kikalos back and put them on have like no other tier names. Because then they're going to search Shaylin. And then Shaylin will give them access to Dweller. Yeah, I think that's probably just the right play. Go ahead. Dump Rhino. They're gonna search. No, let's see. What do you grab? Could grab Scream to have more mills. Could grab Shaylin as the other level 4 that they need for Dweller. Um, maybe they feel like they can already get to that. Should be very concerning, especially with no DD Crow or anything in rotation. So yeah, I'm going to dump Rhino. Rhino effect, discard Merle. Oh, they search Merle. Okay. Activate Rhino. So summon. Dump. Actually, what did they start this turn off with? Why am I blanking? They went special summon Medora, discard. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah that's what they did. So new chain link. I'm going to go Rhino chain link one. Or Merle Chain Link 1, Rhino Chain Link 2. Just try to go into Collado. See if I can um, do anything good. It will be enough. So resolve. Just go dump a Nix. It's going to get put back right away, anyways. Summon. 1, 2, 3. Bring out. And at least I have some bodies too, so if they want to go for Dweller, you know, they're going to have to apply some pressure on these bodies. So use this, shuffle back Kikalos, get that out of here. 
So they have Merly. They can still play. I have no Darks in Grave. That's a, that's a plus. Oh, they actually just scoop. Get out of here. Oh, Leah. Search Merly over searching Shailen there. Crazy. Crazy. One Crow, one Orange Light, two Maxi. To Shailen plays two Rhino, but also plays a Supreme Sea Mare, which, in my opinion, is just a worse Rhino. So you should definitely be playing more Rhino and less of this card. This card, I know it's not an Aqua, but like, come on, it, it, I think it's a better mill. Helps you with your tier stuff. Um, one Keldo, one Kelbeck, probably only has one of each. Rainbow Bridge Exchange, a bunch of engine. Yeah, I just realized that just a whole lot of engine. And playing Orange Light with only seven other fairies in their deck list. Um, yeah, nothing, nothing too crazy. I'll go ahead and show off my deck real, real quick in case if anyone wants to go ahead and copy that. So edit the deck. So here's the current list. Um, some things I just changed was I took out the second elf because i took out diviner so i don't need that package anymore so i play the elf gigantic downard package because you can go like i don't know for example uh summon dark dark effect take dd crow make elf elf effect summon back out dark use those go in the gigantic battle phase attack with 32 downard zeus so that's like like an obscure way to be able to get to a four material zeus in a game state where usually you wouldn't be able to do that much except for pass and an elf on their turn and pray so that's pretty good i know instant fusion is going to have to come out tomorrow i don't know what i'm going to change for it exactly yet it's not like this is too of an important of a card in the deck it's just kind of a a broken one of that if you happen to draw it's just broken so it's going to have to come out it hurts the consistency a little bit uh, i don't know i don't think i'll add another foolish burial goods I don't know how I feel about that card all the way yet. Um, especially when I added like another Rota and I played three Rhino. So, I don't know. Uh, we'll find out. And with all that being said, the Master Rule Grinders signing off. Peace. Have a nice day. Stay safe.